What's going on, my Scorpio kisses? I love, love, mm, love you guys to the moon and back. <laughs> you know that. To my OG subscribers, what's popping? What's good? To my newly subscribed, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for allowing the channel to continue to grow. We appreciate that. To all of you guys who like, share, subscribe, donate to the channel, you totally rock. And I totally appreciate each and every one of you guys and your awesomeness, okay? This is the Scorpio Affair, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node. Anywhere you have Scorpio placements in your chart, grab your boo, your hookah, your dog, your cat, your bird, whatever it takes, Scorpio, to tap into these energies like we always do around about this time. If you should see an ad, don't be a hater. Let it play for a minute. Let's so so your girl can get all the credit from YouTube. If you like a personal reading with me, you need to catch me on a live when I'm running a special. Or you need to be a part of the Scorpio Kisses community. Alright, they have total access. I love, love, love you guys so, so much. Let's get into the energies <clears throat> and see what's going on. Um... I'm hearing like somebody dealing with some type of bad addiction. For some of you Scorpios, I don't know if this is you or if this is just in your energy. It's gambling. For some of y'all, it's drugs, alcohol. This person just can't give it up. I don't know if this is you or them. You keep saying if you don't stop drinking, if you don't stop drugging, if you don't stop hoeing, if you don't stop whatever the fuck, you leave them. But you've been saying that for years. They don't believe you. This person, this person thinks you'll never leave because of your loyalty, Scorpio. What this person don't know is you love yourself a little more than you love them. You went into this um, eyes. Why should I hurt? Okay. Let me cut it in. Yeah, the four pentacles in reverse. Your first card. You releasing this person. You realize they mean you no good. This person played enough games to last three lifetimes. You have the sun in reverse. You didn't even know this person, Scorpio. You still don't know this person, Scorpio. What I said. The queen of pentacles in reverse. I feel like this person was a strain on your finances. I feel like even though, you know, opportunities came your way, you were not able to, like, um, you know, embark on what all those opportunities were because this person was very jealous. This person needed validation. This person needed to be around you 24-7. They don't trust anybody, so they don't even trust your relationships with other people. The Ten of Cups in reverse, yeah, this person... This person, I ain't saying they ain't mean you no good, but what I'm saying is this person knows that they haven't done the work that they need to do to heal, like their past pains. This person, they know this ain't you. They got them feeling in this funk. Okay, the Queen of Pentacles in reverse, they know they're coming from a place of black themselves because of how they feel about themselves. The Ten of Cups is in reverse because... This person sees love as a curse, but it's something about you that's attracting them to you. But the thing about it is they're, they're ashamed of their, of their past, Scorpio. They, they're wearing several masks because they don't want you to know that they were sexually molested. For some of you, Scorpios, this person shared this with you and you, you know, because of where you were in your journey, you had to leave them the fuck alone, just period. And... Oh, well, um, I feel like just being connected to this person is draining your finances. I feel like, too, with the sun in reverse, you're just not able to, um, you're not able to, like, clock whatever this is, but you just know it's not doing, it's not serving you any purpose. You have the five of pentacles in reverse. You know you have to get rid of this energy, Scorpio, in, able, in order for you to continue moving forward. Yeah, the three of wands. I feel like it hurt for you to let this person go. Yeah, the ace of wands. You and this person used to have so much chemistry together, so much love for one another. 
It's like, where did all this shit go? What happened to this person? That's what I'm getting. This person was supposed to make you happy. Yeah, the nine of wands. Instead, this person tested your faith. <laughs> and anything else that had to do with you, I just feel like... In your hindsight, you felt like anything worth having, having was worth working for, but not in love, Scorpio. You don't be loyal to people that's not loyal to you. And if you find yourself in some type of cycle where you're doing this over and over again, sources like saying to you, you know to evaluate yourself. Because this, this then becomes a situation you put yourself in, not... A victim, all right? Not the victim mentality. Yeah, the moon. See what I'm saying? A lot about this person was held captive. They left it. They didn't They didn't give you a chance to make your own mind up about whether or not you want to be in this type of entanglement. I'm hearing something about an entanglement. This person is 555 on the time of year. They probably married to somebody else. Yeah, the emperor is showing up. And then the page of pentacles. I'm hearing children involved are involved. Yeah, on the bottom of the deck, the hermit. I feel like Scorpio, this person ghosted you a lot. And they had to because this person had a whole nother family going on with the ten of pentacles in reverse. But they're not happy. I feel like nothing about this relationship is abundant. Nothing about this relationship makes this person want to do better or heal from past traumas and hurts. I feel like, too, with the Five of Pentacles in reverse, it's like this person, they, they having a lot of type of mood swings and, like, on drugs or whatever. I feel like every five minutes, their, their thoughts, their beliefs change. This person is very unstable. Because they refuse to do the work. I feel like this person always get to a point where they can heal themselves and then they regress. Because they don't know what's on the other side of healing. Like they're, you know, with the moon card here, they're familiar with how to deal with the pain. How to transmute it, how to seek pleasure and, you know. But with this situation, they they don't they don't want to know the particulars. I feel like they feel like this is going to take them off their course or like... They're not going to be able to um, come back from whatever this is. This is what I'm getting here. So let's see. Let's get into the messages here. Whoa. I feel like, Scorpio, this person, they didn't expect you to... Um, like, release them the way the way that you did for them from them not being um honest with you okay if, if that makes sense like with the four of pentacles in reverse this person thought they had more time and it's like one one strike you out with scorpio now about certain things is what i'm getting clarify this four of pentacles what's this four of pentacles yeah the five of pentacles in reverse you got that twice i feel like this person you know, Scorpio, your 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 love, dedication, and loyalty to this person made them feel as though they could live a different life. But I feel like with the four of pentacles in reverse going to the five of pentacles in reverse, it's like you realize this person stuck in this energy for a reason. It's, it has nothing to do with you. You you realizing that you you because this is familiar to you. This 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 spirit is familiar. This person is comfortable with being on either side of that five of pentacles. They they're okay with people just leaving them the fuck alone and nothing not happening in their life. They are okay with isolating people and not nothing going on in that in their lives. And that's why you're releasing that energy because that energy is. Not measuring up to your energy. Yeah. What I said. The six of pentacles came out in the reverse. So the five of pentacles. So you went from the four of pentacles. Scorpio. Y'all better know what the hell going on. My spirit team here. You go from the four of pentacles in reverse. To the five of pentacles in reverse. To the six of pentacles in reverse. Scorpio. Source is trying to let you know that this is a bad deal. Okay. This this is non-negotiable. Like read the fine print. Don't marry this person. Don't share a bed with this person. Judgment is here. 
this person is being judged. This person is going through a dark night of the soul. But this don't have nothing to, to do with you. This person got to pay the piper. This person is being, um, this person, you're calling judgment on this person, Scorpio. So you were this person's karma. Yeah, the king of swords. I'm also hearing something about somebody having to, having to, um, like, uh, confess something on their deathbed here. Yeah, the lover's card. I feel like somebody confessing something to you on their deathbed, Scorpio. That they're sorry for what they did to you, how they traumatized you as a child or something like that. And I feel like you're able to release whatever this energy is and move on. I feel like with the sun being here in reverse, this was sort of like a family type boo. I'm also getting too with the lover's card. You're, you're breaking a generational curse here, Scorpio. Clarify the sun in reverse. Something was hidden from you as a child, but as an adult, you were able to pick up on it. Yeah, the hermit. The dark night of the soul. Yeah. This person, you got to let this person, you know, go be healed. Because I feel like this person, even whether they know it or not, Scorpio, they're in the dark night of the soul. I feel like you you know that. Yeah, the ace of pentacles in reverse. You know that this person is about to be pinched. You know this is God chastising this person. And you understand, you know what frequency this is. Whatever this frequency is, it don't feel right to you, so it's time for you to flee. I just heard flee. That don't mean pack up, that mean go. The queen of wands coming out in the reverse. Yeah, this... This is whole other family this person got going on. This person is being exposed and stripped, Scorpio, and you can't be a part of this. Yeah, look what I said. The two of cups in reverse. This person got a whole nother family somewhere. Here you are trying to build something with this person. And here you are, you're the page of wands. Y'all building. You thinking this person being honest with you and they're not. And with the four of pentacles in reverse being your first card, like you, you, you reading this energy. Yeah, the four of wands. You know something ain't right about this, about y'all connection, about y'all's agreement, y'all contract. You could, this person could be married to two people at the same time. They never divorced the other person in hopes that they'll one day be with this person. They just not holding their life up. They feel like you somebody, you a good placeholder, Scorpio. It's like, bitch, no. I'm nobody's placeholder at all, period. And won't start now. Yeah. The three of cups, nine of cups. This, per this person wants you. I'm hearing bear with the pain. It's like, no. 13, 13 on the time. This person wants you to wait on them. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. It's like, bitch, no. Look, the Ten of Pentacles again in reverse on the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. It's like a definite no for Scorpio. I'm not waiting on you for what? For you to tell me you can't leave your situation. It's difficult. You feel trapped, but you feel obligated as well. You would never leave this person after I done gave you 10, 13 years of my life. It's like, no. Yeah, the Eight of Pentacles here. You move on, Scorpio. You pour yourself into work. Yeah, the sun. Upright. Don't nobody. This person don't have to reveal themselves to you. You already know who this is. The way this person is moving is letting you know who the fuck they are. Period. You know this person got somebody else now. Why they they not able to they, their actions not matching with what they saying out their fucking mouth. And then at the same time, this person they disappear too much. Yeah, the five of cups in reverse. No more dealing with this shit. And when I say dealing with it, it's like you depressed and happy and going through shit and you really don't even know what the fuck going on really. This person think they cloaking themselves and now you're finding out who they really are and you're done. Yeah, the seven of pentacles in reverse. You're not investing in nothing else in this shit. You realize this shit is rocky soil, baby. This soil ain't shit. This soil ain't got no nutrients in it. What I said, the ten of cups in reverse being clarified by the eight of cups. Good for you, Scorpio. 
I'm here and say no more. This person ain't, you know, it's done. When it's up, it's up. Your whole overall energy is the hermit. It's like you walking away from what's been hurting you all this long time. What I said, the star, you, you, Scorpio, you did too much work on yourself. Whether this be physical, spiritual, psychological, for you to be taking anxiety medicine, the moon. For you to be with somebody you can't fucking trust. Somebody who always hiding secrets. When you the master of hiding secrets. But for some reason you open with this person. Yeah, the knight of swords. You open up quick. You ain't want to leave nothing out there on the table. You thought this was your, your equally yoked partner. The strength card in reverse. You lost yourself in this shit. Whatever this shit was, you lost. But you found yourself quick. Yeah, you found yourself. I feel like, Scorpio, you, you, you really couldn't see past what you wanted with this shit. In the beginning. But I feel like it's just like with this person, it's constant. He, he the emperor. I feel like this person very arrogant. This person feel like you need them, bitch. I might not have more, as much money as you and as many in business, but I'm comfortable. I promise you that I'm good. I'm, I'm straight. I ain't finna put up with nobody else's bullshit. Like, that's what I love. Clarify this five of pentacles in reverse. This somebody, ooh, the emperor. Yeah, this somebody who wanna control your energy. Soon as I said that he came out again. It's like, bitch, I'll pass. Yeah, the Eight of Swords. This is somebody who want to make you feel trapped. Somebody who want to control you. This could be somebody older than you, the magician in reverse. They could. This could be somebody who do love spells and shit because they know they they know they they can't genuinely love anybody. What I said. They know they can't love nobody. They go in this shit knowing they're gonna break somebody hard because they refuse to do the work. Why? Because they feel like what they doing now is easier. Why hook up with Scorpio if I got to explain myself? I just move on. The problem is, bitch, you're not able to move on. Because whoever this is with this five of pentacles in reverse and now the five of swords, you and your feelings, you and your head, you all over the fucking place. Now that Scorpio done removed themselves from this bullshit, now you don't know which way to go. Because I feel like at best, this person had to drop a lot of people even to deal with you. They had to free their schedule up in order to go forward with you with the three of wands here. And it's, but it's like it's all catching up with them, and and you're done. They can, you know, your whole thing is why involve me? Leave me out this shit this year. That's what I'm hearing. Three of Wands. Leave me out this shit this year. If y'all want to play fucking games, play with somebody else. Yeah, the king, the, the king of Wands. It's like you about movement, not not people playing with your life. Like keep that shit moving. You want to do something else? Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune. You on your purpose path, Scorpio. And I feel like people just dropping like flies. Yeah, the nine of wands coming out nine in reverse. You ain't no, you, you're not a victim. You way past that. Why? Because you did the work. You fit, you went, you went past the finish line. You finished first. Finish first of who? Not everybody else. Your journey. You were your own competition. The three of cups. Now you're able to celebrate. Why? The four of pentacles again. Sources driving this home. Release whatever this negative energy is. This X, whatever this is that's holding you back. And here you are on the Three of Wands, you're releasing it. You're letting it go. This person been holding you back because they've been in your energy this whole time to get to this Ace of Wands. Clarify this Ace of Wands. You ain't fucking with it, though. The Seven of Pentacles, you done playing with this person. Yeah, that um, Page of Swords in reverse. It's like you're no longer seeking the same thing. You're looking for something different. I feel like for a lot of y'all, y'all going to have a whole different, like, career path or like your your whole business is about to change you're gonna like do something different yeah the, the tower i can't make it up the page of swords and the tower you finna switch up the game on some fucking body what i said you finna switch up the entire game on their ass yeah the queen of swords in reverse you moving quiet you moving very silent this person ain't gonna know what hit them no you ain't lying to them yeah look they go to um <laughs> the high priestess you moving in silence you're building some type of empire behind this person back. Yeah, look, the two of wands. You strategically planning something. They ain't gonna know what happened. And nine of wands, why they trying to clock you and play games and be manipulative? Yeah, the ten of pentacles. You're moving forward. The boy that cried wolf or the girl that cried wolf, they just crying now. You can't even hear them. You're on a totally different frequency is what I'm hearing. Yeah, the temperance card. I feel like you're being spiritually guided where you can't hear the noise, only only the good shit, only the celebration, the three of cups, people honoring you, people celebrating your commitments here. Yeah, the three of wands twice, what I said. 
you're expanding, Scorpio. And you're going up because why? You keep dropping folks. They keep dropping like fives. Why? They they don't have the character to hold them there with you. You're figuring this out now. You realize um, God is perfect. What I said, the four swords in reverse. You realize God is perfect. You realize your soul perfect too, wherever, it, wherever it's at. You also realize, yeah, with the eight of wands, you got a lot of work to do, Scorpio. For a lot of you, Scorpios, a lot of travel involved in your anthropology. Whatever this is you do that just makes you feel good. You don't do it for money. You got money so you contribute to whatever this is. Clarify the moon. You're feeling good, Scorpio. Yeah, the devil coming out in reverse. It's like with the moon, whatever it was that was plaguing you, God said, you don't have to speak it in the chat. But you're free of it with the devil in reverse. Comment in the chat, I'm free from all addictions, all codependencies. Yeah, the empress is here. Clarifying the devil and the moon. And you also have the page of wands. You're seeking new, you're gaining new territory, Scorpio. You're gaining new territory here. Your, your, your path has changed. Something totally different happened. You changing your creative path is changing as well. People, people are saying, where's Scorpio? Where's Scorpio with the hermit being your overall energy? Bitch, getting justice. Getting back to me. Being on my beaten path. Clarify the two of swords. Making healthy choices. Yeah, the ace of cups. New love coming in. Self-love here. You're making choices that promote self-love. That promotes... You getting better, not worse. What I said, the three of cups, three of pentacles. You're building, Scorpio. You're building a solid, solid foundation. People are investing in you. Yeah, the hierophant. People want to be a part of whatever it is you got going on. Why? Because whatever this is you got going on, yeah, the uh, ace of wands twice. People know you're passionate about it. Nobody else is doing it as well. With the emperor, you're pulling the six of cups in reverse. You cut this person off. This person no longer has access to you. You're the empress. They're the emperor. Until they get their shit together, they can't They can't have no kind of communications. For some of you Scorpios, you could have had to get a restraint order on this person. Your nine of swords is in reverse. I feel like you're sleeping better, better because you either got like a alarm system or you put a restraining order on this person or you got like some type of firearm or something. You feel protected from this person or your person is there with you protecting you. Yeah, the king of pentacles. I feel like this this divorce broke this person. It tied up a lot of their money. And when it was finally let go, yeah, the page of pentacles. The good news came to you. This person didn't win. I'm hearing it was cheaper to keep you. But they didn't want to. They thought they were going to win. They thought they outpowered you. Who who thinking they fucking with God? That's it, It's like crazy to me when I think about it. On page of pentacles, seven of wands. Wherever God lifted you up. Two, it was where you were supposed to be anyway. Like you have staying power wherever you at, Scorpio. That's what you manifested. That's why God told you don't look at the numbers. I'm in control of um, promotion here, the Nine of Cups. You're getting everything you wanted, Scorpio, the King of Cups. I'm hearing wish granted. I'm also hearing like... You're getting your, like, purpose partner, like, eternal partner. This person's supposed to be in your life at this appointed time. You're the page of cups. Everything this person do is right. Everything this person say is right. The seven of cups, seven of swords is in the reverse on the bottom of the deck. Which lets me know this person, they have a plan. Um, I feel like you may question this person a lot because they different than what you used to. But I feel like this person being strategic, if they're if they're doing any anything that has to do with like negotiating a deal with other people, they deal with other people differently than they do you, Scorpio. So how they work and negotiate has nothing to do with you here. Um I feel like your dream I feel like energetically saying too, your dreams are being realized. I feel like Pandora's box is opening for you. I feel like a lot that's coming to you too, Scorpio, that you thought you waited all your life for. I feel like you've changed. The things that are coming your way are in so much of abundance that they're going to like. Like, I feel like it was a time when you was homeless and all you dreamed about was, was you having somewhere to stay and then having some type of 
like business or not business, but like charity where you, you know, house homeless women and children or something like that. I feel like energetically what I'm saying is your your passion is about to change because of what you just went through in this last journey you went through. And I just feel like you're being blessed because of it. I feel like everything that needs to fall is falling. Everything that needs to stand up and come towards you is doing that as well. I feel like you know you you you're at a point in your life where you're no you're not able to play games with anyone. I feel like you're on task with the hermit. I feel like you disappear when you need to, so that you're able to strategize, so that you're able to outthink your enemy, your ops, your opponents, whatever this is, and to you know quite frankly just keep moving forward. And I'm also hearing Scorpio stop saying you're just trying to keep your head above water, like your head been above water. And if it go down, you a water sign. You you you're adaptive, adaptable to water. Stop telling yourself things you don't want yourself to believe, especially like your consciousness. I feel like a lot of Scorpios need to reprogram how they think about certain things and what they say out of their mouths. Because I feel like we say it so matter of factly, but it's really like changing how we feel and limiting our beliefs here. All right, what's the tea for Scorpio? The first one out is Beetle. Good fortune. Absolutely. What I said. You gonna believe it or not, Scorpio? December. We already in December. I'm telling you, but it's it's already flowing, bro. It's already flowing, bro. Bad total care. Take care. Enemies are working against you. You know that. You know, um, you know, more money, more problems. Shit. Them the kind of problems you ask for though. When people say more money, more problems, Scorpio, like, I want them type of problems, okay? That was you told the universe. I told you, be careful. What you speak, November is here. Wreath is here. Someone, oh, sorrow over loss. Some of y'all are not stepping into that great, that uh, good fortune energy. Some of y'all are still focused on what you lost. And whatever you focus on right now, Scorpio, is what's going to multiply in your life. Lion, time to act. It's time to get busy, not to get pitiful. Table, it says hard work ahead. Yeah, let's go, Scorpio. Angel, it says spiritual guidance, protection from harm. What I said, you right where you supposed to be at. And anybody that's not, they got to go. And you reevaluating every fucking thing. Caterpillar, yeah, this took a long time. Things will not always be this way. Change is coming. What I said. Ram, a stubborn, aggressive person. That's this emperor you got rid of. Tiger, doing something risky, taking a chance. Yeah, I told you, some, something about your career path is changing totally. And whatever, whoever this emperor thought they were to you, you showing that bitch, bitch, you're nothing to me. There are plenty of emperors, plenty of fish in the sea. What you didn't know was, I'm not the one. You know, I can catch a fish without a hook. And an a emperor, I can catch... Without any fucking thing. So don't act like you're doing Scorpio a favor with this fuck shit. Yeah, success, overall energy on the bottom of your deck. This somebody who underestimate who they were in your life. <laughs> they underestimated you. Flowers happening. Somebody giving you your flowers, Scorpio. Somebody not underestimating you. Somebody glad you there. The star card, they know exactly who you are and what you're going to be in their life. This your purpose partner, eternal partner. Romance is in the air. Rose could be significant. Your name could be Rose. This person could send you roses all the time. Flowers, flowers, rose, bouquet. Um, compliments from an admirer. Yeah, I feel like this, whoever this person is, they're going to always send you flowers. Yeah, butterfly, a change for the better. What I said, January is significant. An older woman could be significant. Dolphin, financial gain, usually coming from something you did in the past. So, Scorpio, everything for you is looking up. Why? Because you choose to just love on yourself. You choose to keep empowering yourself. And you know whatever that attracts is what you need. Right? You're not trying to attract anything yourself. You're just trying to improve on what you need to prove on. Not your higher self. You're already your higher self. But whatever you feel like will make you better for, 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 for the world, not just for one person. For you, for humanity, for the universe. That's what you're aspiring to do. And what you're finding out is the more you go towards that, which to me, hindsight is seeking God's face, then everything begins to unfold and you realize this tiresome race that you've been 
that you've been running wasn't yours in the first place. I, I just energetically feel like life is opening up to you. You're really beginning to see spirituality clearly. You're really beginning to see that there is life after death. And whatever that is, um, I feel like you're getting closer to God because of it. All right, Scorpio, if you're still with me, like, subscribe, join the membership, let those ads play. Every time you tip the channel, it's very appreciated. I'm going to start randomly picking people to send body scrubs and body butters. Okay, I'm doing really good on this side of it, guys. So I want to give away. I want to give back, right? I love you guys so, so much, Scorpio. I'll see you in the next video.